this. Whoa, that was close. Wow. Jesus Christ. wasn't intending on coming out but uh, this is quite the lightning uh, storm we have down here there's a major cell which has just come across Lake Ontario and it's just to the uh, east of us right now like over Niagara Falls way and heading towards Rochester in the state so it's skimming past the very eastern side of Buffalo and there's another storm cell coming in behind that one which could come a little bit closer to us here in Fort Erie uh, so this is pretty uh, Insane, amazing lightning. I've not seen lightning like this for a very long time. As you can see, uh, this is wild right i'm not gonna stay out here too long because i don't want to get hit by, hit by lightning so my safe is best probably gonna be in my vehicle so it's exactly where i'm gonna go Ooh. didn't like that one <laughs> right i'm up by uh on highway three here just outside of burley burley road top end actually top end of bernard uh road this lightning is absolutely intense. Whoa. I just don't know where to look with the camera because it's all over the bloody place. Starting to rumble a bit now. Whoa, that was a good one. Thunder's getting louder. Straight down that way is a town of Fort Erie. Literally just like five kilometers away. Uh, over that way is Niagara Falls. It's like a bloody barrel um, cannon going off. That's getting really close. Oh, is that a funnel cloud? Okay, try and see whether that's a funnel cloud or not. You see that? Right, I'm going to put my windows up on the safe side. Ho, ho, ho. 
All right, as you can tell the lightning's really, really bad. I'm actually getting a little bit nervous sitting here. Here comes another car flying around. It's, whoa, that was close. Wow. Jesus Christ. Ah, he's another one. Ooh. Jeez. Woo! Wow. <laughs> All right, slow it down a little bit. Brain's coming down really good here. As you can see, I just did a full 360 and we have lightning all around us. Right now, it's a lot, it's a lot more sheet lightning rather than fork. But I don't want to stay out here for too long and uh, I don't want to risk my hair getting more spikier than what it really is. Now, the rain's starting to come down again. I, I might just move into Fort Erie a little bit more. Look at this. Now my camera probably won't pick this up, but there's quite a bit of uh, leaves on the ground down here. A few small, small branches. I'm just wondering whether they had a little micro burst around here in the last few minutes. It's kind of like fall on the ground, all these leaves. Well, the surface water on the roads is coming down pretty good. All right, coming up to the end of Canada. <laughs> Getting close to the Peace Bridge and the border. Lightning is not giving up, but uh, not seeing much uh, fog lightning. Most of it seems to be sheet. This is where we are right now. Uh, road is partially flooded here as well. As you can tell. <laughs> Alright, we have a tree down. You can see. It's been completely uprooted. Gee, what a mess. Definitely looking like some kind of microburst might have come through uh, this area. Uh, a lot of branches, twigs, uh, a lot of debris on the road. Um, yeah, so I've not come across any wind driving around, but looks like this part of Fort Erie got it. There's another tree down in the garden there. Another tree over here. I don't know if you can see this. That's a bloody big tree.
uh, Dominion Road, bottom end of uh, Fort Erie, heading towards Ridgeway Crystal Beach. A lot of surface water on the road. As you can tell, you can hear it's really, it's like chucking it down, pouring it down. what we're chasing usually I put these graphics up on my video but I'm using a GoPro today so I'm not really going to spend much time uh, editing uh, but those are the storm cells that have been heading in and uh, that's what we're going to try and capture really quickly All right, that's your lot. Storm's over. It lasted, what, probably like two hours. So not a bad storm. One of the better ones we've had for a very long time.